So we've got good news and bad news. The uh, bad news is uh, I had to start over. Now, I had to start over. The pH, I couldn't control it. It got out of hand. And one of the reasons that I f figured out was aeration. Aeration is a huge problem. So what I have done, and I'm going to show you this. I'm going to have to pause every so often. You might not notice it. Um, aeration. So, I put the Venturis in. I tried playing with this guy. Um, still not getting enough aeration. So, I wasn't happy about that. I um, Where did I put that piece of pipe? I didn't just... Here it is. Um, so, I was thinking of a way to hook up my other Venturis, which were giving me some oxidation, but not a whole heck of a lot. And um, I decided, why do I have to reduce it? There's, there's no reason to reduce the flow. I don't want to really reduce the flow, because that can harm my pump. So I took the half inch, 600 PSI. It's fairly thick. And I drilled a hole about an inch in and then I cut my airline tube at a really steep angle and I sheared off the point end so it would all fit inside the half inch pipe. Now I'm going to go ahead and do that and um, then we're going to go outside and I'm going to show you uh, what happens when you do that. The old way and the new way. See you in a few. Real quick I'm going to show you how I drilled the hole. Got to get rid of the little plastic pieces there. The, I don't know what you call it. But there's my hole. And that is just a tiny bit smaller than the tubing. Okay? See outside. So I'm sitting there thinking I've got adequate aeration. I had it in the barrels. They've been removed. And put it directly into the table and I put it into the table like this see the air hose coming out and there's my Venturi working as hard as it possibly can okay and that still wasn't enough to get my new crop going so I'm like okay well running two pumps that's a heck of a lot of electricity and yeah I put my other green Venturi in there and he's trying to pump away. I, I got to save on the electricity, guys. I can't justify my hydroponics unless I um, can afford it. And the water and the, the aeration are your busy, biggest expenses. So, since I'm not solar yet, See, look at these guys trying to grow. Their, their roots are just brown. I mean, these are the ones that should have popped up as soon as I cleaned out the table and redid everything. Look at this. Look at that. I've got a whole foot and a half of nothing but air bubbles coming off of the system I just designed. Look at that. It's flowing all the way down the table. I don't know if you can see all that. Flowing all the way down the table. So that air is now getting to the roots of my plants, and I'm hoping that whatever roots are left, take it and explode with it, because that's what happened. All my roots started dying, and at first I thought it was all the pH regulation. Then I thought, well, it had to be the bugs. Well, that might have contributed, but it wasn't the end-all, be-all. What it was is not enough aeration in my tables, period. Um, so, we're going to see how this works, and uh, I'm going to show you real quick. I'm going to try to prop the phone here. Let's see if I can't do that. I don't know if this is going to work, but we'll see. Oh, maybe not. All right, guys. So, I got my half-inch pipe with my hole drilled in it. And what I want to do is I want to take this 
and put that end, the long end, at the short end of the pipe. I want to basically kind of block the thing. Let me see what I can do here. This is going to be fun. Alright. This is how you do it. Just like this. Just like that. You want to block the outgoing. Okay, this is where the water is going to come in. Right here. And it's going to flow past this. And it's going to create a, a, an air break and pull a vacuum and pull the, the air in to go with the water to the outflow. Now this is only about, I'd say, five to six inches long. I had it longer. I had to cut it down because I wasn't getting the flow that I wanted. I actually had it about two feet. <laughs> and I noticed that the bubbles, because um, I was trying to use this, the micro sprayers, as my aeration pipe to get more bubbles but that 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 wasn't working once I put that solid pipe in it worked it works fab fabulously obviously you saw that so um, I'll see you again hopefully in another week sorry about the delay I was too busy trying to propagate and get these guys going and when they started dying on me and the roots started turning brown I was like there's got to be a, a uh, solution to this I put some hydrogen in the water uh, hydrogen peroxide and uh, these guys just exploded with the hydrogen peroxide some of them are still aching but these guys over here just went boom okay so and that nutrient on the top there is from the bubble of the current processor it, it is what it is um, this video is getting a little bit too long, and uh, I'll see you guys in a week. <laughs> Happy growing!